Happy Friday everyone! Today is April 3rd, 2020 and you made it through your first week of online learning. Congratulations, we survived. Alright, so here is our video for today. It's a quick one. Um, so again, you're doing a very similar activity to what you've been doing the past two days. Um, so like just like usual, answer the daily attendance question. You're already watching the video and the activity is really to finish your El Nino, La Nina chart and map. Um, so today you're focusing on just La Nina, so you're going to be completing the chart portion and then drawing the map um, again using Kami. And then when you're finished, you will um, submit that. You will turn that in to me in Google Classroom, so make sure you click the turn in button so I can see them and then you will work on a forecasting practice that I put together for the test on Monday. Um, just an extra word about the test on Monday, it is in a Google form. Okay? The Google form will lock you out of your internet access but you may still use your notes. So before you take the exam, make sure that you have yourself ready. Make sure you have your binders out, make sure your notes are ready if you need to have something printed out from um, Google Classroom print it out. Um, just make sure you have everything ready to go so you can take that exam on Monday. You can take it just like um, any other assignment anytime on Monday, um, but it has to be Monday. Anytime from 12.01 to 11.59, anytime during that time period. Also, it is not a timed exam, um, so you don't have, you know, a half an hour to take it. You can take it over the course of three hours if you want to. Okay. Um, if you have any questions about the setup of the exam or um, any topics in the exam, please post them in the Padlet site and I will answer them as soon as I possibly can. Um, there is forecasting on the test. That is why today's practice session is about forecasting. Okay? And it is a Google form, so you will find um, the answers right away once you submit your own. Okay, um, so El Nino and La Nina, quick recap. You learned about neutral, you learned about El Nino, and now you're going to do the last one, which is La Nina. Um, the first thing you're going to do is actually check your El Nino column um, against my key on the next slide. Um, and you will see the chart, you will see the map, and you're going to make sure that your answers are correct. Okay, um, just make sure that you um, check everything out on Tuesday of next week, you're going to be in a, doing an assignment that is graded and you're going to be using your chart and using your map. So please make sure you have everything correct so you can use that uh, appropriately. Um, so again, I posted the article. You're going to use that to fill out the La Nina column. You're going to use that to fill out your map in Kami. Um, to get access to those, you can go back to previous posts or you can pull them up in your Google Classroom folder. Um, whatever works better for you, um, but you can go back to those same documents that you were working on yesterday and Wednesday and continue to work on those guys. Okay, and again, um, on the next two slides are the answer keys, and then when you're finished finally with all the short-term climate change information, then you will complete the Google form posted for um, practice for a Monday's test. Uh, I hope you all have a great weekend and I will see you online on Monday for the exam. Have a good one.